Hello. Another week of wintry weather ahead. For many, Monday's looking pretty good out there. It's a bit chilly, yes, but there's plenty of sunshine around. Just a few scattered showers. If we take a look at the satellite picture, you can see the spots here. There, the shower clouds moving in. But just behind me, there's something a bit more threatening. This big mass of cloud is a spell of wet and windy weather that's going to arrive overnight and for Tuesday. Ahead of that, though, as I say, for many, it's a fine day out there. Yes, some showers just drifting in at times into parts of the west. And we'll continue to see snow showers across western Scotland. The showers further south, mostly of rain. Some hill snow possible over northwest England and a mixture of sleet, hail and a few snow flurries across Northern Ireland. But for much of the east and central Britain, it's fine. It's bright. It's sunny. There's a bit of a cool breeze blowing, although it's not quite as strong as yesterday. Temperatures still below average for most, though, 4 to 7 Celsius. And those temperatures will fall quite quickly as the sun drops this evening. A few more showers across the south overnight. It's sort of rain, but that does mean it could turn quite icy. And then here comes that spell of wet weather sweeping into Wales and southwest England, accompanied by some pretty strong winds. So very wet and windy here and a mixture of rain and snow across Northern Ireland and pushing into Western Scotland. Temperatures again dropping close to freezing in towns and cities, so again, ice is a potential hazard for the morning. Wet and windy start for Wales and South West England, some snow for Northern Ireland, that could cause a few issues through the morning rush hour, and then we continue with some snow flurries across much of the day for Scotland. The rain pushes across England, turning into the east eventually in the afternoon. Some uncertainty about the progress of that rain, but it does look as if many western areas will brighten up come the afternoon. But it is going to feel cold, I think, wherever you are, particularly stuck under the cloud, the rain and the snow, which continues to pull away out into the North Sea through Tuesday evening. So clear skies follow on for Tuesday evening, and again, that means it will turn cold with the potential for ice. If I just head out of the way, though, you'll notice there's another band of wet weather waiting in the wings. That will arrive on Wednesday, accompanied again by some stronger winds. Staying cold for most of this week, but there are signs that once that band of rain clears through on Wednesday, it may turn a bit drier and a bit brighter. There's more on the weather through this week on our YouTube channel, and there's always more on any weather warnings on the Met Office website.